All right, straight ahead, it's a light heavyweight matchup between Dan Henderson and Michael Bisping. So here's the former UFC middleweight champion, Michael Bisping. Unbelievable career for Michael the Count Bisping. Not a lot of people thought he would eventually realize a UFC championship. That's what he did in 2016. Few men have won more UFC fights in the history of the promotion than the 38-year-old Michael Bisping. Michael Bisping has some of the best cardio inside the octagon. He's also one of the most underrated fighters in the UFC's middleweight division. Time after time, he has proven himself amongst the best in the world. So here he is, Dan Hendo Henderson, one of two men to simultaneously hold two titles in a major MMA promotion. His future, undeniably, is in the UFC Hall of Fame. He was a US Olympian in 1992 and 1996, and went on to become one of the best knockout artists in the history of mixed martial arts. You know about the Dan Grenade, you know about the H-bomb. Hendo will be looking to find a home for it yet again tonight. Dan Henderson is a true legend amongst legends. He is a former Pride two-weight champion, former Strike Force champion, and one of the best knockout artists in the history of the sport. Our tale of the tape for this light heavyweight tilt. More than five years apart, and they both possess a similar height and reach. We send it inside the octagon, we find Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC light heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. The mixed martial artist holding a professional record of 31 wins, eight losses. He stands six feet one is tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of Manchester, England, he is an Ultimate Fighter season winner, Michael! And now, this is his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a Greco Roman wrestler and holding a professional record of 32 wins, 15 losses. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 205 pounds, fighting out of Temecula, California. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. Herb Dean draws the assignment here. Ready to fight. Ready. First round underway. Well, it may sound trite to say he got here with blood, sweat, and tears, but that is the book on Michael Bisping, the former UFC middleweight champion who realized that UFC title 10 years into his UFC career, plus skills in all areas. As such, he has become one of the best middleweights on the planet. Look at that. Nice. Joe, how do you think he approaches this challenge tonight? Dan Henderson is known for his brutal knockout power, but many people forget he was also an Olympic wrestler and a very good takedown artist. Henderson gets touched by that leg kick attempt. Punch to the body. No good, it's blocked. Well, he got his head snapped back there, Joe. The straight punch lands flush to the head. And again, he's just not doing things defensively that you want to see. Move that upper body. Get that head off of the center line. Right now, he's just leaning right into his opponent's range. Oh, he has mastered the range here, timing his shots nicely. This thing gets the takedown following that nice combination on the feet. You don't see that every day, Joe, but he is mixing it up well tonight. 
Just over two minutes to go in round one. Nice shot to the head. And busy as he looks to improve position here. He's back to his feet, but he's hurt. Good body shot. Oh, nice inside leg kick right there. And there he swung with a haymaker. Oh, nice jab there by Bispin. That punch is good. Big oh, shots. He's, he's got him right here. He's getting tagged. Oh, big left hook there. Five seconds to go here in round one. Oh, one, two. So we cross the 30 second mark in our opening round. Nice jab there by Henderson. They continue to exchange. Beautiful left hand there. Try to establish that jab. Oh! The horn sounds for the end of round one. Here's a perfect head kick. Here's a powerful leg kick. Here's a perfectly placed leg kick. Some really well placed strikes on display in that round. Okay, listen, next round. Ready fight. Ready. All right, let's get to round two. At the end of the... Oh! This could be it! Anderson gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up, Joe. Nice jab. for the victory. Yeah, Joe, a pinpoint strike to end this fight. It landed flush. I'm not even sure the opponent wholly saw it coming. And before he could recover, the referee was in to stop the fight. So a huge knockout victory for that fighter here tonight. Let's see it again. Tremendous force. And that's a wrap. And here we see it again. Crank right on the jaw. Well, what a moment for this fighter here tonight. A massive knockout on the sport's biggest stage. Seminal moment for that fighter tonight. Now we go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop for this contest at one minute, eight seconds of round number two. Playing the winner by knockout, Dan! So there's the man of the moment, just the way he drew it up here tonight as he gets his hand raised and does so emphatically by way of the KO. Perhaps some bonus money is coming his way at the end of the night, I'm not sure. Still a few fights to go, but at the very least, you can be sure his next fight will be a big one, and he will celebrate deep into the night with his teammates.